All right, I am adding um, a part two <clears throat> to halfway rectifiers uh, because I don't like long videos, and that one, that last one, was getting a little bit long. But there was a couple things I wanted to show you on this simulator that may help you to understand. We already went over why this is a half wave rectifier and how it clamps it, uh, this diode, how it clamps the uh, negative part of the signal. Uh, I just want to show you how you can see that actually a little bit easier. If I put another probe, let's say right there, <clears throat> this is where you get the full signal and then it's being clamped here. If we now run this, you can now see the full signal. You can see the full signal here uh, goes up to plus 20, down to minus 20. That's your normal sine wave. You can see that it's one kilohertz from here to here. Now, one thing that I didn't mention is why uh, the signal here does not go all the way up to 20 volts. I'm assuming some of you would already realize this. I hope anyhow. It would be really nice if you did. But you have to take into account the drop in this diode. If you look at how far away, if I can, I'm going to get rid of um, this probe. I'm going to run it again. And if I go up to the top of that, I'm at about 19.3. Well, there's your 0.7 drop through that diode. So we have to take this into consideration. If we're, if we're needing to guarantee a, a 20 volt peak, we're not going to get it using this diode. <clears throat> what we would have to do is come back and change our ratio in order to make sure that this peak was actually above the 20 volts. So I just wanted to add that. You can um, add different probes. I could have put a probe on the 200 and the 20 and it would have showed you the difference. As a matter of fact, let's just do that real quick. I haven't done this yet. So if it doesn't work, you know, sue me. And now if I run that, there you go. There is your 200 volt peak to peak. And there's your 20 volt peak to peak. It's a good indication of exactly what this does for us. Our half wave rectifier part two.